This video here is about how to enable your TPM or Trusted Platforms module chip on your laptop. Now, I'm using my IBM ThinkPad Busy61T9442E7U to do this video, so obviously a different microphone. So if it's a little different, I apologize for that, but I couldn't do that on my pavilion because that doesn't have a TPM chip. Now, to learn if you have a TPM chip, go to device manager. Hit the start button and type in device manager. And that's the first one under programs. I just booted so things may be a little slow here. So when you finally get that open then go over and if you can find something over here that says security devices you expand that and then there's a trusted platform module in there like mine's 1.2, then that, then that would mean you have one. What it is, is it's something that certain programs can take advantage of to trusted platform module 1.2. I, I don't know, but it, here's how to enable it. Start control panel. Go to BitLocker Drive Encryption. Now I'm going to start off by saying that this is only in Windows Vista Ultimate. So if you're not using Ultimate and you're in XP or Home Premium, Home Basic, Business. I think all I think Enterprise has it too, if you have that. But this is mainly for Vista Ultimate. 32 or 64, but they're the same. I'm in 32 now. Down in the bottom left, you're going to see something. TPM Administration. If you don't let me zoom in there. TPM Administration. Click that. This is going to open up the TPM window inside the control panel and then BitLocker Drive Encryption window. That always takes a couple seconds to open. Then on the right hand side you're going to see under Actions, Initialize TPM, Turn TPM on, Turn TPM off, Change Owner Password and Clear TPM. Now I don't know how other computer manufacturers do this, but with with IBM you can do this, click that, something like that, and then that didn't do it, but then you have to reboot your computer and then the BIOS can enable it, change ownership, and do things like that. So if I were to turn it off, then I would have to go and reboot and enter my password. So lots of things you can mess around with here, be careful. Over on the left, you can see overview, st status, TPM management, and TPM manufacturer information. So hopefully, that can help you use that. And I think mine, yeah, mine's on right now. I don't need it. I don't have programs that could take advantage of it, but maybe you do. And uh, usually, most IBM ThinkPad or Lenovo ThinkPads do have that. So good luck with that, and thank you for watching.